Hey, good afternoon. My name is Larry Reagan. I'm the project facilitator for the X-Files project. It's my pleasure this afternoon to introduce you to J.R. Ryo and Kurt Winkleman. JR is a professor of information and science technology at Penn State University, and Kurt is professor of chemistry at Florida Tech. Kurt and JR have served as the co PIs on a project called X Files that we'll be learning a little bit more about. Uh, today's session is really to introduce you to the idea of this jam. What is a jam? How does it fit into the larger X Files project? And I've asked JR and Kurt maybe to share a little bit about what the initial project is, and then we'll talk a little bit about how the jam is going to fit into that. So JR, if it's okay, I'd like to start with you. Can you tell us a little bit about X-Files, what this project uh, means? First of all, let me say that we're very proud of our acronym, X-Files, very catchy. <laughs> <laughs> but X-Files stands for Exploring Future Innovative Learning Environments. The goal here is really to better understand how emerging innovative learning environments or also known as ILEs can help with teaching and learning uh, in the near future. Just to give you some examples of these technologies, these include things like cross-reality, artificial intelligence, personalized and adaptive learning and multimodal learning and we'll have an opportunity to get a little deeper into what these technologies are a little later. Kurt, tell us a little bit about the concept of this jam. What's the what's the idea behind a jam and maybe what is a jam? When we spoke with faculty and people from industry, we got a lot of good, good feedback from them, but we realized that in order to fully understand how students expect to use this cutting edge technology in their future education, we really need to hear directly from them. Uh, students bring a, a really unique perspective and creative ideas. So we're looking for students from all disciplines, not just science and engineering, uh, including education majors, uh, students studying social sciences and the psychology. The arts, yeah. Anybody with an interest in how we teach STEM using technology uh, should check this out. The projects they develop at FileJam will provide insights about education challenges and opportunities that they expect to face over the next few years. It centers around solving a, a challenge or a problem that's presented to them. Jam focuses on teams developing uh, an idea or designing a, a, a product or a project. In a jam in this particular case, the X-Files jam is going to be conceptualized as a one-day event, right? That's correct. We're looking at a, a, a jam that's going to start in the morning and end by late afternoon. I think the date we're playing with right now is February 8th, that's 2020. Correct. Uh, in Melbourne on the campus of the Florida Institute of Technology. So registration information will be available on the website. Uh, you can look for the uh, register here link on our uh, X-Files Jam website. And uh, in the next session, we're gonna do an interview. We're gonna unpack a little bit more um, about the event. What's it gonna look like? How might it function? And, and also explore some of the technologies Kurt had mentioned and JR both had mentioned that we're working with sort of four classes of technology and we want to explore those a little deeper. So uh, thank you both for joining us this afternoon and we look forward to talking to you again soon. Thank you.